डू यू नो हाउ टू डू जी आर एन इन एस एफ पी इट्स वेरी सिंपल लेट्स क्रिएट इन ए मिनिट और कपल फर्स्ट ऑफ ऑल रिक्वायर्ड परचेज ऑर्डर नंबर करेंटली वी आर हाईलाइटिंग इन द प्रेजेंटेड स्क्रीन डेफिनेटली परचेज ऑर्डर शूड कंटेन सम क्वांटिटी करेंटली वी कैन सी क्वांटिटी इज ऑल्सो रिफ्लेक्ट इन आवर प्रेजेंटेड स्क्रीन एज वेल As soon as quantity reflected, what we can do is will we navigate for another transaction code. Now we are putting that transaction code in the transaction bar and press enter. As soon as you press enter, your interface will look like this type. This is called the receiving interface. What we can do is will we copy once again this particular purchase order number. Prior before one more thing, one more step, I need to intrim to all of you is. their egs talk definitely lie under for this particular material we needs to understand whether and how much talk is available to that so that it will be concrete whether the goods is shipped done successfully or not for that what you can do you have to go for a another transaction code as per the presented screen you guys can enter the transaction code and successfully execute it by using the material number system will display you the actual stock what should be the stock the stock is 20 quantity then we can move to our previous copy the purchase order number and as we already open then we can we can go to that particular transaction or if you close that particular transaction then what you can do is you will be open with a new one currently we are opening with a new one what will be the next in the particular interface you have to put your purchase order number as we are going to put it over here currently you can see some executable button okay let it be slightly left now you can see a executable button execute it as soon as you will execute the information will populate in the presented screen but now you can see that the information is not yet populated the document does not contain any suitable item it is a real time scenario guys and you may face this kind of issue don't be hurry don't be panic select here for the goods receipt and as soon as the purchase order is coming into the picture then you can put your purchase order number and similar process you can execute it active your tag as well that's called the item should be ticked then save as soon as save then what will happen your goods receipt done successfully that validation you will be do it in your another transaction code 